changing defense, a high risk, high reward defensive effort by Louisville. And for the Cardinal, they're going to have to make shots. Deanna Smith backs it out. Mikasa Robinson, and here is one of those rookies, Haley Van Lith. Robinson mid-range and gets it to go. And we'll keep our eye on Kai Crutchfield as well. She has been the lockdown defender for the Wolfpack as Kiana Smith hits the bucket. Looked like it caught Elisa off guard that the smaller defender was coming over on her. She'll try to wrap it around the backside and does. Standing in the Big West at Cal State Fullerton before arriving this year to replace Ace Koenig. Over the top. And it's good for Kayla Jones, the senior out of Janesville, North Carolina. No Louisville's an up the line overplaying team. It's a terrific time to go back door. Here's the other freshman in the lineup. And oh, Olivia Cochran showing off okay. the skill. Who came to the title game last year and played well to help NC State win their first title in 29 years. And Gunane in the one on one is too tough to deal with when she gets two feet in the paint. Me, Jeff Walls gets her off the ball for this set, puts her over to the wing so he can get her to her right hand. What a great call from the bench. Gunane trying to back in on Dixon, gets the touch. Good passer out of the post. Perez for three. Got it. Wanted to show up in their notes for the NCAA tournament, right, there Debbie? <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Kai made the plays. Uh, low to my Lautman. And the jumper is good. Full of folks. No, I don't think there's any question she's in the conversation for that as well as a, a potentially number one or top three draft pick yes. for sure in the WNBA draft. McDonald was the player of the year out west uh, for Arizona. Yeah, Stanford is very good, very balanced, very hard to defend, and the best defensive team Tara Vanderveer has had in a long time. Alana Smith with the spin and got it up and over Kunane. Words on ESPNU. It will be an S curve from 1 to 64 as Brown Turner scores on the left side. May open up an opportunity for one of those teams that initially finishes outside the bracket. There could be a replacement as the Wolfpack get the takeaway. They are the defending ACC tournament champs. They won it last year for the first time since 1991 in the Kayao era. Reina Perez with the rain drop. For a top 10 team, she's helped make them a final four potential team. Best assist to turnover ratio in the league. And Marika Pono, confident after a double digit scoring effort in the semis with her first bucket today. The first team ever to beat two top ranked foes on the road. And they will score inside, and there's Boyd over Cohen. They're analytics, but they have great instinct and feel for the game. And you can see the adjustments that both of them have made so far in the game. They know each other so well. Oh, Smith able to knock it down. If, if Louisville becomes a jump shooting team, that is to NC State's advantage. Crutchfield. Got it. Assistant Kunane. They've played a lot of this second quarter without Dana Evans on the floor. Haley Van Lith knocks it down, and that's her first bucket. One for five to start today. She does not get a look there, but Haley Van yeah. Lith does and is fired up after back-to-back -back makes. Bono's pass to no one in particular, and it's nothing but black jerseys around it. In the trail. Good for Boyd. Smith led them with nine points in the first half. Balanced attack for the pack through the first 20 minutes. Here is a catch for Kunane. And a move to the rim for two. Yeah, that's not, uh, that's not the shot. Turner. That's not what Jeff needs. Jeff Walls wants his team to move the ball. And when you don't take shots in the offense, then you cannot get back in transition. Leading scorer, better than 20 points a game. Nobody on the men's side in the ACC scored 20 points a game this year. Off the backboard and in for Brown Turner, and she's hit a couple in a row. Maybe NC State hasn't done a good enough job of getting her to the line. 8 0 run for NC State, and it ends right there. Kiana Smith. Brown Turner gets it into Kunane, immediately faces up and gets stripped from behind. Smith running with Evans. Dana leaks out behind the line, finds a driving lane and the window. 
It's a great dig by Kiana Smith from the backside. And Dana's first bucket in 20 minutes of clock time as Kunane counters with the basket. Cochran sticks in mid-range, good. Nice work inside, good interior passing. Back to Evans. Dana in the lane. That one was bothered by Kunane. Cochran, multiple opportunities for the cards. But I don't remember the one we won. I remember the two we lost. Oh, no. Dixon. Got it to go. And Alana Beard and Alyssa Thomas, three-time regular season MVPs. And ACC history, some of the all-time greats. As Camille Hobby turns and hits. Switch back is what I meant. Dixon got muscled out of the paint. And a nice drive to the rim. Dana Evans lays it in on the left side. Louisville back in front. Thinks she's got the advantage. Tough shot, good defense by Dixon. Here comes Evans, three on two. Smith running the floor, and one for Louisville. Going to play from the sideline. He's sensing Dana needs a shot. And Dana goes. gets a shot. That's why he goes to Horns. Two bigs on the elbow and let her attack. Off the bounce. Here she is, ball in hand. Good help. Kono got to the rim. I mean, maybe got away with the travel. Well rested, turns it over. He didn't play those last couple of minutes of that third quarter. Evans in the trail for three. Got it! Uh-oh! Kai Crutchfield. Good. The one thing NC State has had in the fourth quarter all season long is offensive maturity. Yeah, they're going with four guards. Van Lith tries to relocate. Perez on her defensively. On that left hand. Nice feed to Robinson! Kunane really fighting and battling inside with Cochran for position. A touch for Kunane off glass. Cochran now kind of post up, faces up. Working on the All-American. Oh, good Cochran. for Cochran. Big girls going to work right now. Back to Kunane. Immediately doubled. Perez will try and open things up with the three. No. Boyd swooping in for the stick back. Throw the double at Perez, Reina handles it, now Kunane, space! You let her get to that left shoulder and that half hook. Evans keeping the dribble alive, tried to thread the needle and it's picked off. Crutchfield, one on three, will take it herself, in and out. Second chance, third chance! Evans, Evans can go either way with it. Yeah, that horn set has been dangerous for NC State with Evans with the ball. Waving to the bucket, that's why. We go again with Dana. I don't know if there's another player in the country who has confidence at this point in the game more than Dana Evans. Oh, well, Cochran couldn't handle it, and it goes back to State. Ties it. This is the second. NC State only one team foul. Dana, no good. Rebound, Kunay. Perez will keep it and take it and hit it with 2.1 to go. Timeout Louisville to advance to midcourt. When the first option isn't there, Debbie, you better be ready if you're plan B. I mean, this is a terrific play. I talked about offensive maturity. NC State doesn't need to call timeout to set up a play. You don't want Louisville to change their defense. You want to try to score as quickly as you can, or as little time on the clock. Inbound to Evans. Good if it goes. And it comes up short. NC State back-to-back -back ACC Tournament Champions.